If you've ever needed to create a macro in Excel, it's easier than ever with the help of Copilot. Even if you have limited to no VBA experience or coding experience, it's possible to do so. I'm gonna show you how. So in this table, I've got sales data, and let's say I wanna highlight all the rows where the sales in column G are at least $500. So as long as I've got my data selected, I can click on the Copilot button here, and I'm gonna ask it to to create a macro which highlights every row when the value in column G is at least $500. And I'm gonna specify it should highlight every cell in the row yellow when this condition is met. So the key thing is we wanna give it enough detail so that Copilot knows precisely what we wanna do. So in this case, I'm setting the criteria for column G is at least $500. And if the con condition is met, then highlight every cell in the row yellow. So I hit the play button or the run button. And now it's gonna go through my request. And now it's gonna formulate a, a macro that I can use in Visual Basic to, to execute this, execute my request. And this is a lot easier than using Excel's built-in macro recorder, which is gonna record every possible, every step that you take, even unnecessary ones. It's not gonna be as efficient and it's not gonna be able to handle situations like loops or if statements. With Copilot, it's possible to do that. So here it's created a macro for me. So what it's gonna do is it's gonna give me a description of what it's doing. So it says to create a macro that highlights every row in yellow where the va value in column G is at least 500, you can use the following VBA code. Remember, you will need a macro-enabled workbook to run this code. So setting up my variables, it's telling, um, telling me what they are and putting in comments as well. So it's assuming my data starts at row two and goes to row 1,000, adjusts the range accordingly, clears any conditional formatting, and now it loops through each cell to say, okay, if it's greater than or equal to 500, now highlight the entire row. So it's setting the cell's interior row color to, to be yellow, and then cycling through. And now it tells me how I can, how I can use this macro. So let's use this macro for all these steps. Alt F11, open the VBA editor, insert a module, paste the code, close the editor, and then run the macro by hitting Alt F8 and selecting the macro to run. It says, make sure to adjust the sheet name and the range according to your actual data. This macro will highlight the entire row in yellow for each cell in column G that has a value of at least 500. So it tells me what it's gonna do, and it gives me the code and instructions on how to add that code into Visual Basic. So I'm gonna grab this code from the end sub all the way to the very beginning at the, at the start, the sub. So I'm gonna hit Control Z, Control C to copy it. And I'm gonna open up Visual Basic. And I've got it over here. So I'm gonna insert a module, just like it told me, paste it in there, and it's done. So I pasted the code in there. Now what I can do is now I need to save this as a macro enabled file before I can actually run the macro. So I've saved the file now. And now what I can do is try to execute that code. So now if I do as it says, go to Alt F8, we've got my macro there, and now I'm gonna run it. So it should highlight every row with the sales values at least $500 in column G. So I'm gonna hit run, and just like that, it's done the job. So it's run the macro and exactly done what I wanted. So every value of at least $500 or more, it's hotted the entire row, every cell in the row. So it's followed the instructions, it's created a loop, and it's to told me how I can adjust it or how I can insert it into my macro. So it's a really useful tool for creating macros. And you know, if there's something off or you want to adjust something, you know, you can tell Copilot that you want to you want to adjust it or you want to do a slightly different different code in there. And so it's a really useful tool for for creating macros and you know even if you have limited experience you can set that up to make sure that it's it's working how you 
how you want it to, to work. Because with, with, with the built-in macro recorder, you're you're quite limited in what it can do just because it's going to record every single step. It's not going to be able to do loops. It's not going to be able to do if statements. So with, uh, with Copilot, it makes that process a whole lot easier. You don't have to go through looking through code or anything like that. You can easily just... Um, tell Excel exactly what you want to do, and it's gonna create that code for you and walk you through the process of how to add it into your, into your workbook.